Hey guys, today I'm going to be reviewing another Her Given Hair wig. Of course, it comes in a nice sturdy packaging. It's inside, the hair is inside of a bag. And then also, they always include a little pamphlet that tells you how to take care of your hair and everything. And another cute feature, they have a timeline which lets you know the history of the company and everything. So I will say that they have the best packaging that I've tried so far. Like, they are very detailed with it. So inside of the little bag, you get an elastic band, you get two... Uh, clips and then you get two of the clips that kind of snap at the end so you get four clips and all so I took the hair out of the plastic bag first and now I'm taking it out of this hair net this is what it looks like in its natural state so the wig comes with three clips already it has two on the side and one at the back most of the cap is wefted and then they have a small piece which is laced at the front and it also has an adjustable band so this is what the wig looks like fresh out of the box so it's not too flattering when you see it on the website you're like Ugh. a lot of people didn't even believe it was the same wig whenever i posted on instagram but trust me once you wash it it, it comes to life watch you gonna see so after i rinsed the wig under the water i added my tresemme luxurious moisture conditioner i'm just co-washing it they recommend that you just co-wash this hair you know just to keep it soft and to make the curls pop so after i add it of course i am going to detangle inside of the sink and um it may look like i'm yanking on the hair but i guess it was the way that i was holding it i promise i wasn't pulling it that much and you'll see in a minute that i didn't get that much shedding now i'm just rinsing the hair out with water as you can see the curls have definitely elongated at first it was a little smush but now they seem like they came to life they're more moisturized and they're longer i received a small amount of shedding as usual i never have a lot of shedding when i work with her given hair i just have my natural hair braided to the back now i'm going to put on a wig so that i can style it i'm going to do a twist out so the first thing i'm going to do is add the kalahari smoothie leave-in from curls dynasty this leave-in has become one of my faves it's very moisturizing and it's lightweight so it doesn't feel like it's weighing your hair down or anything i'm making sure that i am putting that all throughout all of the hair i'm going to section off one side and then this is so easy y'all this is the easiest twist out ever all i'm doing is pulling medium sized pieces from i'm starting at the top and i'm working my way on, down to the bottom i'm pulling medium sized pieces i'm adding the curls dynasty twisted definition twisting cream and then twisting it down twirling it at my ends and that's pretty much it it's like i mean it's a one two step thing and I'm going to do that all the way around my head. By the way, that uh, detangling comb that I'm using is the Conair detangling comb. My favorite detangling comb, hands down. I have a link to that down below. So it took me about 35 to 40 minutes to twist all of my hair up. And that was it, y'all. That was it. To give you a little bit more information about the wig, this is the Proud of Your Coily wig unit. I got the cap size in a medium. The hair length is 14 inches and the color, well the lace color is a light brown color. So the twists were nice and juicy and moisturized when I was done and I just went ahead and took my wig off and let them dry on my mannequin head. So this is the next day. It was probably about 24 to 36 hours later because the first day I did it in the morning and then the day when I took it down, I took it down at night. So it was way over 24 hours. Before I put my wig on, I cut off the extra lace in the front and I also put my adjustable band on as tight as possible. Now I'm just putting the wig on as you can see. The lace in the front is all gone and it's not seamless it doesn't look perfect because I don't think this wig is intended to really have that lace you know front all that showing because it's only a small amount of lace and you can even see that there the brown part from the cap is showing so definitely make sure you separate your hair all the way so that that part isn't showing um, I would not recommend wearing it in twists like this because uh, your stuff going to be short. But anyway, to take down a twist, I just separate them once and then I'm going to go back and separate them again. Now, usually I always say to separate the hair where it naturally wants to separate. But this hair is so coily. It has so many curls and coils in it that 
it doesn't really matter because the hair is going to be curly regardless. So as you can see, I'm not being super gentle when I take the hair down. And you can see that those curls are already starting to pop. Now my hair is not 100% dry. It was probably about 90% dry. It was still a little damp at the roots. But for the most part, it was dry. And um, as I'm styling the hair, by the time I get to the end, it'll be dry. So it's not uh, that big of a deal. So when I was all done taking the hair down, I picked it a little bit at the roots with my hands like I usually do, but there wasn't enough. So I had to pull out the, the handy dandy pick and I'm going to pick that. And as you can see, while I'm picking the hair, it's just coming to life. It's getting bigger. It's getting the shape that I love. So it already comes pre-cut like this with the bang and everything. I did not have to cut this hair at all, y'all. At all all this the cut of it is amazing this is my favorite her giving hair wig that i've ever tried ever because it's just perfection whenever i wore it i was able to just throw it on every single day and it just looks so good y'all i just love this hair so much like let me have my moment Hey guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. This is the Proud of Your Curly Wig Unit from Her Given Hair. If you guys want more information about where you can find it, I have all the links down below. And I am going to include a few clips so you can see how the hair progressed throughout the week. I'm sorry y'all, I'm not that good at taking daily pictures, but I do be on Snapchat and I am on Insta Stories, so make sure you guys are following me. So that first one was day one, this is day two when I'm at work, and you can see that as the days went on, the hair got bigger and bigger, but I did not have to retwist my hair and I wore it for my whole work week and it looked just fine. I got so many compliments on it. Uh, and it looks so natural. People thought that my hair, this is my hair. I was like, no. You think my hair gonna act like this? No. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I love you guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.